Hello everyone, this is Travi and I got requested to do a sponsored video and check out this website and give it a little bit of a review. So, let me just do my Steam login and we're gonna have a look. Trusted service, 9 out of 9.8, 1749 reviews. All legit, no taxes, amazing service. Awesome, epic, just epic. Okay, so this one works really good. Fake reviews play consumer websites. The Guardian. Trust Pilot. Website founded with which publishes reviews. Trust Pilot featured fake reviews from Busy Loans. Ah. They take your reviews down regardless of how you praise it. Write a review, go back a month and a week from when you wrote it and you will find it's been removed, archived, etc. without notification to yourself. Waste of time, a very shady company. Okay, so Trustpilot is not really trustworthy, which is kind of ironic with the name, isn't it? But okay, then we know that we can just ignore Trustpilot entirely. Because with just a little bit of research, you can find out everything. But I guess this video will serve as the tool for that. Sign in via Steam. Done that. Choose items. We'll get to that. Get cash instantly. We'll see if that happens. Okay, so I got pretty much an idea of how it looks. L let's have a look at the actual prices. Okay, this skin. 1 euro and 15 cents. Apparently there's some kind of discount on it and you automatically log in with this five percent so usually companies use this to kind of trick you make you think oh i actually get a sweet deal but i think this is more so of a mind trick don't, don't fall for that so let's have a look at csgo then this skin how much euro 1.88 1.88 well, for these kind of sell websites, that's kind of understandable since that's kind of like their whole market. They work like that. They buy it for slightly cheaper and then sell it for, well, kind of the price that it goes for. So, yeah, this is understandable. As long as the, the percentage of loss isn't too huge or if you just can't lose a skin for the life of you, even though you've been trying for, like, weeks, I'd say that's... Uh, that's a pretty decent deal. But how about something that's like more expensive? Um, what is the most expensive thing I can sell here? Let's have a look. All right, I'll just save you some time and let you know that they don't really seem to buy a lot of TF2 skins, not even Australians or unusual weapons, not even uh, like the skin weapons we got from those cases a while ago. So... This seems to be very CSGO oriented with only some of these. I mean, they don't even take unusual hats. Which is also kind of counterproductive. But then again, a lot of unusual hats can be very expensive. But, let's see what is actually the criteria for being sold. You know, th they should really also put a search engine in here. That you can just skim through your items way quicker. That's a little bit of feedback for you there if you're watching this. Which I'm guessing you do. And I have to say, I like the layout. It looks clean. These sliders, I don't know. There's just something so clickable about them. Wow, whoops. Yeah, this is where the search engine could really help. When you like, maybe like uh, a drop down here and you select uh, Australian skin, um, strange, unusual. That, that would really help, like, making this p process a lot faster. Alright, here's an Australium. It's an Australium SMG, and I cannot sell it. Let's have a look. Skins do not have value for the community. 18 euros, 40 cents. It does have a value. There's even been three sold in the last 24 hours. So, that's not it. The skin's value is less than 0 0.6 US dollars. Well, it is, we just saw that. Or more than $400. It isn't, but I sure wish it was. The skins cannot be transferred among Steam users or sold at the Steam Marketplace. Three have been sold the last, uh, like, 24 hours, so that's not true. So, I think for a bit of feedback for this website, 
broaden your horizon on what you can sell for TF2 skins. Because here I also have an Australian Islander. Not that I would sell it, because it's a donation from a fan. Thank you, Tubby. But I am not sure why Australians are not sellable here. I mean, why not? There's a good market for them, and hell, they're still popular. I still like the look of them. I even prefer them over unusual weapons a lot of, a lot of the time. So that's a little bit of feedback for you. But let's, let's actually try and sell something then. All right, let's sell these two. Um, to my PayPal? Yes, the exactly that, in euros. Uh, I agreed to receive emails, no thank you. I, uh, I don't really like emails uh, in my spam box that much. Well, let's see that instant cash. I'll get back to this later. Alright, let's give this another go. You and you, PayPal. Try, there you go, try, there you go, alright, trying something a little different, so maybe this will work, well, I'll be damned, so according to this, it usually takes up to 15 minutes, I'm just gonna time skip ahead and see if it actually works, well, it looks like they actually, uh, transferred it to me within like a minute so it looks like the website is legit yeah I gotta say for the layout I like the layout of the website so I think we can round up this review then I say this website is trustworthy I mean as long as you look for the prices yourself on the steam market for a bit and judge if you think that it's a good deal I'd say this website is a legit choice to t try and sell your stuff. Just in case you cannot sell it anywhere else. Because you know that the Steam market takes a big percentage of your money. So if you want to skip that bullshit and just instantly sell it here rather than wait for God knows how long, just go here. <laughs> this website is actually pretty fast. So, I hope this review helped, and uh, there's a link in the description that, that they will know that I sent you. I think it's pretty good, and they even have a live help section, so if you need some help, they'll surely be there to help you out. But, this has been it for now. I am gonna go, uh, go spend that sweet 1 euro and 33 cents. Gonna get me a nice ball of ice cream. Goodbye.